here we go. Rosalina, hey, wait a minute. Didn't this video start off the same way as the previous video? It wasn't the previous video just recorded yesterday. Yes, that's the perk of putting the date for each of my recordings in the title and thumbnails for my series of Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Rapid Races. And by the way, welcome back to another video of the series. Yeah, I'm really trying to get more content out on my channel more frequently. And the main idea is that I want to record walkthroughs on the weekdays. So right now that's Hyrule Warriors, Age of Calamity, and New Pokemon Snap, and online multiplayer matches on the weekends for things such as Mario Kart 8 and Toon 2 and Pokemon Bata and Super Smash Brothers and I also want to do whatever Wednesday videos, but the point is, I'm trying to get videos out every single day with multiplayer content being uploaded on the weekends. That includes Mario Kart 8, and so I figure weekends have two days on them, Saturday and Sunday. So, the previous Mario Kart 8 video went out on a Saturday, and now this video is going to go out on a Sunday. And we're going to see just how different the Friday night crowd is from the Thursday night crowd, because I'm recording this Friday night. So... This ought to be fun! Okay, before this next race begins, I'm gonna go ahead and cut to the intro, and when we come back, we'll see what track has been chosen. Alright, whoosh! Let's move it to it. Here we go. I think there's a strong chance we're going to go to Dragon Driftway. I, I really do. I think the odds are in Dragon Driftway's favor. Oh, would you look at that? When something's likely to happen, it tends to happen. Well, we've got she, or maybe that's Sa. I'm still learning the katakana of Japanese. Player, Naju player. UX, oh well, shiny. Yeah, it didn't have enough time to read all the player names. So I was busy, busy, lamb, jam, Busy talking about how I'm learning Japanese. All right, you get it. I'm, I'm fine. We're here. We're at Dragon Driftway. This course is pretty hype. I'm starting off in the back, but I shall shoot my way to the front. Hopefully. Let's move it to it. Machine. Is that what that person's name is? Machine. Mamon. 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 All right. I got to get past the players here. Let me do this real quickly. All right. I got I got four mushrooms to use. This is, under normal circumstances, a great place to use the mushrooms, but I was busy bouncing off against so many Waluigi's that didn't really have a chance to do so. Man, I recently learned that one of the best combinations in the game is Waluigi on the Wiggler bike, and that explains why there are so many players who use that combination, but you know what? You're playing in a worldwide race against players who don't always know what they're doing, and where luck is a huge component of the game. So really, in a game like this, it doesn't bother me that Waluigi is so good in terms of stats, because stats only mean so much in a 12-player worldwide race in this game. It means more in a more competitive game, like Super Smash Brothers. But here, doesn't matter. But it does help explain why so many people are using Waluigi, and why so many people are using the Wiggler Bike. That's okay, I got plenty more mushrooms, I just want to hang on to them for a brief moment until I get to a more opportune time where I can cut across the off-road with them. So here we go, ready? Don't touch me. All right, one mushroom here, and then I will use this next mushroom in just a moment, right here as I approach the straightway, very good. All right, blue mushroom, <laughs> not blue mushroom, blue shell on the way, here we go. All right, man, first place is really far ahead. Well, I will do my best to try and catch up. I need another mushroom, perfect. All right, no, I want to use the mushroom here. All right. I got it. I slid into the wall, but I was able to use I was able to take the shortcut and hit the player ahead of me. And first place is in sight. Excuse me, Mario. I've got a race to win. Alright, she or Sa. No, okay. Chuck that. Hope for the best. Get two more items. Give me another mushroom. And banana and red shell. Mmm, I wanna use the red shell. I know you're Why? I was gonna say I know you're holding a banana, but it went past you! No 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 no. I will take third! After that, I will I will take third. Alright, I do feel somewhat bad for that Mario player who looks like he got hit just as he approached the starting line. But you know what, my red shell just completely missed. Even if it hit, it wouldn't have stopped the Isabel player, but still. I just cannot fathom how random that race got at the end. And that person's name was Mamon, that one Japanese player. I can, I can confirm that. Mamon. Alright, well, that's race number one. We're off to an interesting start. 
my position after all that in a 12 player race was pretty decent all things considered now as for these courses obviously we're only in the second race of the day so i have not played on any of them yet so i am fine with any of them but for the sake of diversity, I shall go ahead and pick N64 Rainbow Road because I feel as though I've been going to Ice Ice Outpost in particular quite commonly. And Water Park, while not a super common course, I'm okay with not racing on that track at this time. And it feels as though a lot of other players want to pick N64 Rainbow Road as well. <gasps> okay. Speaking long sentences without breathing is a skill that I have somehow learned but am not capable of doing it very frequently. Anyway. I'm fine with any of these courses, though. I'm also fine with random picking something, because I've only raced on one course so far, so as long as random doesn't pick that one course, we're fine! It also appears as though two players have dipped out right now. It seems our odds of going to N64 Rainbow Road are good. Or we're going to go to Water Park. We're going to go to the one vote that picked Water Park. We're out of ten votes. That leaves a 10% chance of it getting picked. We've got Naju Player, UX, OL, Shiny, Runaway, Giggybug, myself, Psycho Rave, and Mamon! Nice! All right! Here we go. It looks like the two players that left were two of the players that pr pretty much won the previous race because it looks like I'm starting off in the second place position. I'm also slightly closer to the right than I am to the left, so I'm going to go for the coins on the right. Not one of my better ideas, but I tried it. Psycho Rave, I see your me. You're doing that thing where you try to make your me look like a hamburger. I can respect that. Alright. Now, the idea is that if you all take each other out, then I can take the lead. I've already caught a draft. That red shell, it looks like it's forever going after you. Am I understanding that right? Okay, now it's not spinning. It's, I think, okay, I guess you were holding a red shell behind you or something like that. I don't know. That Psycho Ray player just had a spinning red shell behind him for the longest time. And it was just confusing the heck out of me. All right, here we go. No worries. Okay, so the thing with the mushroom on this course, obviously a mushroom is generally a good item all around. But on this course in particular, there's not too many off-road segments where that is... An optimal item. So, Red Shell is actually a lot better here. See ya, oh well. I appreciate that your name is oh well. It's like when you lose, you're like, oh well. And then when you win and I lose, I'm like, oh well. I'll get my revenge on you. I'm not going to get the double item box. Ooh, Giggy Bug passing you just because you took a slightly tighter turn. But you know what? I caught a draft. And there, finally, my Red Shell <laughs> hitting the person that's in front of me. And I'll take double items this time because you can't get double coins, so no matter what, I'll have at least one item to protect myself. And I got the Super Horn, the best item to defend myself. The best defensive item in the game. In case someone wants to chuck a blue shell, I should be prepared, but I guess I gotta use it now to take care of this red shell. A shame! Alright, that's fine though, we do what we can. Got myself another banana in case the person behind me has another red shell. Did not mean to bang against the wall, but it did, the, banging against the wall didn't seem like it slowed me down there, so... Doing fine. Daisy's catching up though. I shall have to take all of these turns perfectly to ensure that I maintain a first place position. Okay, I got a bob bomb. I could set that behind me, and I should set that behind me. There you go. Doesn't look like it hit the daisy player. Come on, give me something, give me something, give me- Ah! I got a banana, but I couldn't get it quickly enough. I was like mashing that button. Doggone it. Ah! It be like that sometimes. That's okay. That's okay. I, I, I did everything I could, right? He just had the red shell ready. I mashed the button. I couldn't get the item out in time. And he and I were neck and neck. And we both took our turns as tightly as we could. And we had good lines for that race. And he got the item he needed to win. That's fine. I'll take second place. Not too shabby. I was fine front running that race. It's all good. Now as for the courses here. I race on all three of these quite commonly. So I'm going to pick random. That was definitely on Electrodrome in the previous session. That's the perk of recording this session just after the previous one, is that the previous one is fresh in my mind, so I can better keep track of what tracks have been on recently, and I was definitely at Electrodrome last time. Wild Woods, I feel as though I've been going there quite frequently, but I was not there last time, and I was not on GCN Yoshi Circuit last time either, so... Any of these tracks are fine, because I haven't raced on any of them today. I'm just trying to not play on the same three or four tracks all the time in a game that has 48 tracks, you know? And we are going to Electrodrome, the one lady who picked it has caused us all to go there. I'm sensing a, a, a little bit of a theme. You know, if you're the one person that picks a course out of 10, 11, or 12 players, you're going to be the one that gets that course. The difference, though, is that when I raced on this track in the previous session, which was yesterday, it was mirrored. This time, it's actually normal, so I have a better sense of what the heck I'm doing. So I ought to be good to go! Let's do it. Alright, I'm going to pass. Oh, well. Oh, yeah. He beat me in the previous race, so I can say, Oh, well! Oh, and baby Luigi here took my item. Giggy Bug! No, no, see, it doesn't have the same ring to it. But I do what I can. 
Oh, yeah. No, only so much I can do there. But I'd rather get hit now at the beginning of the race than later on in the race. Because I've got plenty of time for a comeback. And this is my course. There was a time when this was my favorite course in the game. Darn it. I will say, though, not getting an item definitely makes getting a comeback more tricky. I, I just have to hope that all these other players take each other out. I get double items here. Yep, I'm going for it. I'll take the turn slightly wider if it means I get two items. Give me some mushrooms. Yep, four mushrooms. Perfect. Golden mushroom, I guess, would have been a little more preferable, but we'll still take it. Okay, it. Nope. And there we go. Just like that. Back into fourth. How far away is first place? It's a blue shell going around. I just... All right, well, I mean, first place is right here. I just saw the blue shell on the map, but I just didn't see it hit Giggy Bug. Well, I've got a mushroom and a banana. I... Oh, here we go. Blue shell's coming back around. Go get him. Okay, I just want to make sure I didn't get caught in the explosion. This is great! First place with a mushroom and a banana. And four coins. Pretty good. It'd be better if I had ten coins, but hey. I'm crushing it. I will... Oh, I had a feeling I wasn't going to be able to hang on to them. Oh, no, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. Oh, uh, there we go. That one's going to get me. Yeah, it happens. All right. Oh, wow! All right, I got a banana, though, so in case someone else wants to throw a red shell, I'm ready. And yeah, now I don't have a mushroom. That's the part of the map where it'd be the most useful. And that green shell's not going to hit him. Eh, it didn't catch him on the rebound, either. Still... Nope, he's, he's still evading it. Darn it! I mean, I get it. You have a red shell, you may as well use it, right? But, ugh. I just hate that it hit me. All right, let's see. Fourth place, I got to get some decent items, right? Sound, sound box is a great item, but for fourth place, it doesn't do me much good. It's the best defensive item in the game at the cost of being one of the worst offensive items in the game. Probably, probably just behind the banana. So, I need mushrooms. Come on. Triple greens is good, but nobody's on the same part of the track as I am. Even if they were, getting them with a green shell here is pretty tricky, so I may as well use all of these up. All right. Come on, give me, give me a second mushroom. Let's go. And a second mushroom I got. No, a red shell right here. Uh, okay, take the hit. That's fine. I got two mushrooms. Oh, no, not the lightning one right here. I just started taking the off-road segment. Oh, this is horrible. Horrible. That's awful. Awful. Doggone it. I had the right idea. The lightning had to strike just as I started taking the shortcut, huh? Although, if I'm not mistaken, I still gained points for that race because I beat players with higher VR than me. So, I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> I'll take it. It's the luck of the draw, I guess. You win some, you lose some. All right, these courses. Haven't raced on any of them yet. Not... Uh, I, I really don't want to go to Baby Park. I feel like I go there all the time. It's a nice enough course. I enjoy it, but let's let's not go there. I'll just pick random again. This is probably the most I've picked random in any of my Mario Kart recordings ever. I pick it every once in a while, but like four times in a row? Yeah, that's crazy. I'm really just trying to ensure that I have a nice, diverse selection of tracks in these episodes showcased. But I didn't race on any of these courses in the previous session either, so it really doesn't matter. Now, there's three courses we could have picked from. One person picked Baby Park. A bunch of people picked Excite Bike Arena. I don't even remember what the third course was anymore. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. We're probably going to go to Baby Park if previous luck is anything to go by. Let's see what we've got. We are going to... I mean, I don't know. I started off this session by saying a common track is one you commonly go to. Oh, we got random. All right, we're going to Dolphin Shoals. Fair enough. 150cc. We've got Naju Player, UX, OL, Shiny, Right Away, Myself, Emily, Millie, Olivia, Arturo, and Jacob. Love it. 12 player rooms. I love them. I love them. And what do you know? We're not flooded with Waluigi players racing on Wiggler bikes. It's fine if that were the case, but I like seeing some diversity. Look at that. We got Daisy, Bowser Jr., Mario, and Waluigi all here. And I think there was a green Yoshi player beside me. Love it. See you guys later. Yep, there's that green Yoshi player. All right. Oh, well. Time to take you out. You beat me at Water Park. I don't think I beat you in Electrodrome, so I got to beat you here. All right. Got to be very careful here. I want to take the turn tightly, but I don't want to smack into that banana. We're okay. Okay. Did not get the trick there. That's fine. It's not a big deal. Got the trick there. Uh, banana, yeah, I, I said in the previous race. Banana is not a great offensive item. So what I can do... Did it go past him? Of course it did. What is what is happening? I, my red shells keep going past the people I throw them at. It's very unfortunate. I really need to line myself up a little better. Alright, coin. I got my own banana. You are not going to hit me with that green shell. I am going to hit you with this banana. I got it! At the cost of drifting into the off-road. But you know what? It's fine. My momentum is still going. Ah! He got me with the green shell after all. Alright, look, I don't have to get first place. At this point, I just have to beat Oh Well. 
I've kind of created this rivalry for the sake of this video, so I would, I would like to uphold it and fulfill my end of the bargain of defeating my rival. So let's go. I'm in second place. The only person that's ahead of me is this Dry Bowser player. Oh, well, now I'm in third place, but it doesn't matter. Oh, well, is not ahead of me, and I am maintaining a distant lead. No, I'm not. Everyone else is catching up to me. The person in first place is maintaining a distant lead. Golly! Golly, man! What timing for that boo to go after me, of all players. I really needed that mushroom at that moment, too. Oi. Does Boo just know? Oh my god, and I missed the item boxes? I'm in trouble. I mean, I've got one more lap. I'm gonna, I'm gonna recover low there. Got one more lap. I'm in fifth place. Oh, that star player is having a field day right now. Okay. Okay, we're moving. We're just moving. There we go. Give me, give me mushrooms. Triple mushrooms. Perfect. Asking you sometimes shall receive. I do not want to get hit by another red shell. I'm, I'm kind of tired of that. Okay, so oh well was the daisy player. Don't think he's in front of me. So I'm okay with getting fourth place as long as that daisy player is not one of the three people that's ahead. Mmm, I kind of wish I got the double item boxes. That's okay. There's a chance for one more item afterward. Got a mushroom. Okay, the best part of the course would be to... The best part, the best time to use this mushroom would be at the end of the course, but there's one more set of item boxes here and I'm testing my luck. I'm okay. Oh! Well, I guess it's a good thing I used it because I would have lost it anyway. Ugh, I was ahead of him when I got shrunk. So that means he's going to get bigger before I do. Oh, I, I can't do anything about this. All right, well, well, I got fourth. I don't think Oh Well beat me though. Or did he? Is there a daisy player in front of me? I can't quite tell. There's a lot of people in front of me right now. Oh well, passed me at the last minute! No! <laughs> well, good games to Archero, my Animal Crossing me costume wearing player. I respect you. You and I were truly neck and neck at the end. Darn it! Oh well, had a mushroom or something at the end. Uh, man. Oh, for these courses though, we gotta do Big Blue. I love all these courses actually. <laughs> Big Blue and Super Bell Subway in particular are my favorite courses in the game. And then Grumble Volcano is. One of my more favorite retro courses presented in this game. Back in Mario Kart Wii, I didn't care much for it. I liked it. It wasn't my favorite course back in Mario Kart Wii. But here, I, I really like just the lighting of it all. Now, I did go to Super Bell Subway for the previous session. So I'd rather not go there. But I'm not going to be too upset if we go there because, as I said, it's one of my favorite courses. I'd really rather go to Big Blue, though. And it seems like we have a nice even split of votes this time around. And we are going to Super Bell Subway. That is fine. You'd think that after racing there in the previous session that I'd be more experienced here, that I'd have a little bit of an upper hand. But that was yesterday. This is today! And I'm sure some of these players have been racing for much longer today than I have. I'm only racing for about 30 minutes at a time these days, so maybe they have more experience than I do. But the point is, one of my favorite tracks. Really like it. When I was here yesterday, I got first place. Let's see if I can do it again. Let's see if I can beat... Oh, well. Beat this Daisy player. Here we go. We all had decent starts. I figured I was going to pass it at the beginning. But that's okay. That can work to my advantage because a fifth place item will net me a simple green shell. Because your position doesn't necessarily determine what item you get. It's your distance from first place. Unless you're playing with frantic mode items. Which we are not because this is a worldwide race and not a friend room or attorney. Alright. Well, I got that red shell. Let's go. And then the mushroom. And we'll use it here. Not the best place for a mushroom, but just use it up. Get the next double item box. And green shell and boomerang. Boomerang's a good offensive item, but don't really like using it. I'd rather... Oh my god, I can't hit you guys with a green shell, but I can hit myself with a green shell. Fine. Alright, here we go. Triple mushrooms, that's perfect for this part of the course. Alright, hello, Linky boy! You want to share this lead with me? You are welcome to. Don't know if that red shell's gonna do much to first place. I suspect he's holding a banana. So let's try this other red shell! Can't defend yourself with two items. Or, I mean, I guess you could, but I doubt you are. And now that blue shell's gonna hit you. Perfect! I took the high ground just to make sure I wouldn't get hit by the explosion. It's actually not faster. It's faster to stay on the low ground, if I'm not mistaken. So, we'll keep it going. Nope. Hang on. I'm okay. Oh, I'm not okay! I just went face to face with the train! But I'm still moving. Still moving. That red shell did not get me, thank goodness. I don't know if it was because it was targeting a different player or if it got destroyed by a fireball. But hey, this is working out! Alright, give me that first place. Now, I gotta be careful because he's pretty close to me. He could very easily get a red shell. So, really what I need is a banana or a green shell. Please. Of course it's coins! It's Mario Kart 8! How would it not be coins? Oh, man. Alright, I need the double items. And I did not get the double items. I, I turned too quickly. I mean, he's, he's right behind me, huh? I'm hesitant to look backwards. I heard him. I heard him. Oh, I slowed down there. Oh, that was not ideal. Oh, my God. And there's a blue shell going after us? Well, who's it going after? When was it launched? Oh, my God! Oh, my God! <laughs> Alright, I don't know if that 
it was after me or after him, but if it was after me, I got some invincibility there. That was like the perfect, if I go down, I'm taking you with me moment. Wow, neck and neck with a blue shell to determine the winner. I am taking this first place with 10 coins. You won't see me complaining. Woo, baby, that's what I'm talking about. This is my course. Super Bell Subway. Love it. Love it. I don't really have anything else to say. I thought I was going to turn that into a catchy little phrase, but I thought rather than embarrass myself, I just figured I'd say I love it. And you know what's better? I beat Oh Well. <laughs> oh Well got 10th place. I got first. Great. I don't want Oh Well to suffer. I just want to get first place. All right. Tell you what, though. I think this next race is going to be my last race. I have been enjoying myself so far, and I probably should have left on that race, but you know what? I'm not going to. I didn't learn my lesson from last time, because last time... Yeah, I'm referencing the previous video a lot. I have not referenced the previous video in Mario Kart 8 so much. It's just because it's fresh in my mind because it happened yesterday. So if you want to watch that video, you can go watch it. There's a, there's a card in the top right corner of this video that you can click that will bring you to the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Rapid Races playlist. So you can click on that. Anyway, what I was trying to say was I went to Super Bell Subway in the previous session. I think it was also my second to last race. It also had something chaotic happen in it. And I also got first place on it. So, this is working out. As for me, I think our odds of going to Mute City are good. I'm also fine with going to Neo Bowser City because we have not gone we have not gone there yet today. But I'd rather go to Mute City. Oh, not only are we going to Mute City, but it picked my specific vote. And we've got Naju Player, UX, Shiny, Yoshiller, Olivia, Arturo, Frankie, Jake, Sarah, and Ekox. It looks like Oh Well has left us. That's okay, we've still got a fun 11 player room, and because the vote selection picked my specific vote, I get to honk my horn at the beginning of the race, because I'm so excited! Look how excited I am. Ready? Excitement! Excitement! <laughs> there we go. I had to make sure I recorded another character reacting to it. It's first world problems! Oh, it's so hard for me to showcase another player reacting to my horn honking when I'm ahead of everybody. Alright. Darn it, my red shells always go past the person. I need to be further behind people when I use them. Oh, this is no good. Because I started in first place, I don't start off with any coins. But you know what? It's fine. Because getting coins on this track is easy. I mean, it is and it isn't. The only way you can get coins on this track, obviously, is to use the little rainbow pads. But you can get 10 coins immediately like I did there. And also, I've got mushrooms right here, so this is actually pretty perfect. Where's first place? Uh, okay, we're okay, we're okay, we're okay. And there you go. Boom, baby. We're getting it. We are fine. I'm in second place with a mushroom. And this is a fast moving course. Even if I get hit with an item, it's going to be very easy for me to continue moving forward. So I'm feeling pretty good right now. And I'm going to try and hang on to this mushroom until I get back to that little shortcut air make section again. But having a green shell is handy too. I might just have to use it up. No, you know what? I'd rather just get hit. <laughs> Here we go. Oh my god. Oh, hey, that worked out! I can't hit people with red shells, I guess, but I can occasionally hit them shells. Alright, well I guess I'm not doing the shortcut this time. A small price to pay for having a first place front running segment on one of my favorite courses in the game. Alright, and now I've got a green shell so I can defend myself against any upcoming red shells. Here we are. Last lap. Let's see if I can finish this front run, huh? There was a little bit of a challenge there, I do admit, but I should be good. Hello, this is a blooper. I tend to call the blooper Paul in this series. That was Paul the blooper making a brief cameo there. I hope you enjoyed him. His ink disappeared immediately because, as I stated earlier, this is a constantly fast-moving course. Oh, I missed the speed boost. That is not good. That could give the people behind me a chance to catch up. But it looks like I've got a pretty decent lead. That lightning strike, no problem. Oh, but it also looks like there's a blue shell along the way. But you know what? I'm so far ahead, I can see people on the ceiling. I'm on the opposite side of the track. So I'm feeling pretty good. Can I get to the end before the blue shell strikes? Okay, if I can at least cut across here, we're okay. All right, drop that behind me. All right, got myself a little bit of insurance. Oh, people are catching up. Go, 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 go. <gasps> there we go. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. First place, pretty much front ran the race. It looked like there were people behind me that had star power and bullet bill power, so they were catching up, but I just had enough of a sizable lead to not get bombarded after getting blue shield. So I'll take it. Thank you. What's better than getting first place? Getting first place twice, so I'm A-OK -okay with ending the session there. Much better than last time where I got first place and then had to leave after getting like 10th or 11th place or something like that. So folks, it's been fun. Thank you very much for playing. I am going to dip and I am happy that I was able to play Mario Kart 8 Deluxe as frequently as I have been as of late.
Well, I had fun playing today, and I hope that you folks had fun watching too. And once again, my title screen for this game is the Rosalina title screen. It's always, it's always gonna be the Rosalina title screen. There are no other title screens. All Rosalina all the time. <laughs> That's the character they want to market now. It's fine. Alright, folks, that wraps up today's video of Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Rapid Races. And I'd like to thank you all for watching. I hope to see you all in future videos. Bye bye, humans. Whoosh. Hey, thank you for watching my video. If you want to continue to support my content, the best thing you can do is like this video and subscribe to my channel. All you have to do is click the little buttons down below. Also, please be sure to follow me on Twitter to stay up to date with my video schedule. My tag is at RealYoShiller. I hope to see you all in future videos. Bye-bye. Whoosh.